with the emotional thoughts of Brock Mueller. He knows a different side of Rich Rodriguez. Rich Rod and his staff adopted Brock's cause after he was partially paralyzed in a car accident. Brock led the Wolverines onto the field to open this season. And today, he was the most emotional as he walked out of Schembechler Hall. He's always just been shown as a villain, and uh, and he's nothing like that, you know. And, I mean, he's one of the greatest guys I've ever met in my life. And, you know, and I wish people would just acknowledge that. And whether or not he, you know, works out as a Michigan coach is maybe a totally different story. And uh, as little as I know about football, I do know, um, you know, his character is much different than what um, people have played it out to be. I think that was an important soundbite to include on this day because Rich Rod has certainly uh, turned people, many people, the wrong way, but he has done a lot of good during his time here in Ann Arbor, and he will be missed by many people. But 15 and 22, as we've said many times over the course of the last hour and a half, is not going to cut it here for the folks at Schembechler Hall. Rich Rodriguez, relieved of his duties, does not look as though Jim Harbaugh will be his replacement. He currently is meeting with the San Francisco 49ers. Could be Brady Hoke, could be Les Miles could conceivably be Gary Patterson from TCU. Been a busy day here in Ann Arbor. Reporting live, I'm Tom Lydon, Channel 7, Action News. Yeah, Tom, thanks.